Have you ever wondered what grinds the gears of a Sigma male? Sigma males, those enigmatic figures who stand apart from the traditional Alpha and Beta archetypes, are known for their introverted and independent nature. Despite their solitude, they command a distinctive allure, a mystique born from their unique qualities and deviations from the norm. Yet, even these free spirits have their pet peeves. So what ruffles the feathers of these lone wolves? Let's delve into the world of Sigma males and uncover what truly irritates them. Sigma males are often referred to as the lone wolves of society. A somewhat elusive yet intriguing concept, isn't it? Let's delve into the world of Sigma males and try to understand what makes them tick. Sigma males, unlike their Alpha and Beta counterparts, are introverted. They are the individuals who prefer solitude over the company of others. This doesn't mean they are antisocial or lack social skills, rather, it's their choice to remain in the background, observing and analyzing rather than being at the forefront of the action. What sets Sigma males apart is their self-sufficiency. They do not rely on social hierarchies or status for their self-esteem. They are self-reliant and independent, getting their sense of worth from their own accomplishments and abilities. They don't seek validation from others, which often leads them to live unconventional lives, marching to the beat of their own drum. This brings us to another key trait of Sigma males, non-conformity. They are not bound by societal norms or expectations. Sigma males make their own rules, carve their own paths, and are not afraid to go against the grain. They don't care about fitting in, rather they cherish their individuality and uniqueness. This non-conformity extends to their thinking as well. They are often seen as deep thinkers with a unique perspective on life. However, this distinct lifestyle and mindset often lead to Sigma males being misunderstood. People may perceive them as aloof, indifferent, or even rebellious. But in reality, they are simply living their truth, being authentic to their nature. They are the embodiment of the saying, still waters run deep. It's important to remember though, that being a Sigma male is not about being superior or inferior to others, it's simply a different way of navigating through life. Just like the myriad colors in a rainbow, the diversity in human personality is what makes our world so vibrant and interesting. Now that we have a better understanding of Sigma males, let's uncover what irritates them. Sigma males value their independence above all else. This is the cornerstone of their identity, the bedrock upon which their personality is built. They're like the lone wolves of the social hierarchy, preferring to roam freely rather than being tethered to the confines of societal norms and expectations. Now imagine that independence being threatened. It's a safe bet that it wouldn't sit well with a Sigma. They're the kind of people who don't just value freedom. They demand it. They're self-reliant, self-sufficient, and self-motivated. So when someone tries to control them, to impose their will upon them, it's a surefire way to piss off a Sigma male. Consider the scenario of a controlling partner or a bossy friend. To a Sigma male, this is like a red rag to a bull. They don't appreciate being told what to do, when to do it, or how to do it. They're perfectly capable of making their own decisions, thank you very much. It's not that they're defiant for the sake of being defiant, but they simply don't believe in surrendering their autonomy to anyone. Another thing that irritates Sigma males is unnecessary interference. They're introspective individuals who enjoy their own company. They revel in solitude, finding it a wellspring of creativity and insight. They don't need constant social interaction to feel validated or content. So when someone intrudes into their space uninvited, it can be a source of great annoyance. It's not that Sigma males are antisocial, far from it, they can be charming, engaging, even charismatic when they choose to be. But they value their alone time and they guard it fiercely. It's their time to think, to reflect, to recharge. They don't appreciate it being disrupted without a good reason. In essence, Sigma males are fiercely independent spirits who value their autonomy and solitude. Any attempt to control them or invade their personal space is a one-way ticket to their bad side. But that's not all. There's more to discover about what pisses off Sigma males. A Sigma males are non-conformists at heart, and this statement rings true in every aspect of their lives, and it's particularly evident when we delve into what tends to tick them off. 
A key source of irritation for Sigma males is societal pressure and expectations. They are the wolves who choose to walk alone, not out of inability to fit in, but out of a distinct preference for their own company and the freedom it affords. Let's consider societal norms and expectations. We live in a world that loves to put people in boxes, to categorize them, to set standards of what's normal and what's not. The problem here is that Sigma males are not your typical box kind of guys. They thrive outside the box in the wide open spaces of individuality and self-reliance. Imagine being an eagle soaring high in the sky, enjoying the freedom and the view only to be told that you should be in a cage because that's where birds are supposed to be. That's the kind of pressure Sigma males face from society. The insistence on conforming to norms, following set paths, and adhering to traditional ways of living and thinking can be utterly vexing for them. Sigma males aren't rebels without a cause though. They are simply individuals who value their freedom and independence above societal acceptance. They would rather live life on their own terms, guided by their own principles and beliefs, and not by what society deems acceptable or normal. This nonconformist nature is not a whim or a phase. It's an integral part of who they are. They see the world through a unique lens, and that perspective often clashes with societal expectations. So when society tries to fit them into a mold, it's like trying to fit a square peg into a round hole. And that, ladies and gentlemen, can be a major source of irritation for a Sigma male. As we delve deeper into understanding Sigma males, it's important to remember that they are not anti-society or anti-people. They are simply individuals who value authenticity over conformity, personal freedom over societal approval, and individuality over group mentality. And these values often put them at odds with societal pressures and expectations. We're starting to get a clearer picture of what irritates Sigma males, aren't we? Sigma males are introspective, thinking deeply about everything. This deep and profound nature of theirs, however, is often misunderstood, leading to situations that can truly tick them off. One such situation is superficiality, a trait that is almost like kryptonite to these insightful beings. Sigma males don't just scratch the surface, they dig deep. They crave the raw, the real, the unfiltered essence of life and people. You see, they are not interested in the weather or what you had for lunch. They want to know your thoughts, your dreams, your fears. They want to unravel the mysteries of the universe with you, debate philosophy, or discuss the intricacies of human nature. They are seekers of truth and depth. This is why the lack of depth can irritate Sigma males. They find it exasperating when conversations are limited to the mundane, the trivial, and the shallow. Imagine being a deep-sea diver stuck in a kiddie pool. That's how a Sigma male feels in the midst of superficial chatter. Moreover, Sigma males are not fans of pretentiousness. They can see through the masks people wear, the facades they build. They value authenticity, and anything short of that can be off-putting for them. Superficiality to them is not just about shallow conversations, but also about inauthenticity and pretense. And yet, despite their aversion to superficiality, Sigma males do not judge or condemn those who prefer to stay in the shallow end of the pool. They understand that not everyone is comfortable diving into the depths, and they respect that. But they do prefer to surround themselves with fellow deep divers, with those who are not afraid to delve into the profound and the significant. In summary, Sigma males are deep thinkers and feelers. They crave meaningful connections and conversations. Superficiality, lack of depth and inauthenticity can truly tick them off. They are not interested in the shallow end of life. They are diverse, explorers of the deep, seekers of truth and authenticity. Now, we have a comprehensive understanding of what makes Sigma males tick. So, what have we learned about Sigma males? Well. We ventured into the unique world of Sigma males, exploring their distinct characteristics and understanding what really grinds their gears. We've unraveled that Sigma males are not your average Joe. They are introverted, self-reliant, and march to the beat of their own drum. One of the primary irritants for Sigma males is a lack of independence. They crave their own space to think, to work, to simply be. Any attempt to encroach upon this personal space or control their actions is likely to cause friction. We've also learned that Sigma males are non-conformists. 
They don't feel the need to fit into societal norms or to follow the crowd. Therefore, forcing them into a box or expecting them to adhere to common expectations can easily tick them off. Finally, we've discovered that Sigma males value depth in their interactions. They prefer meaningful conversations over small talk and superficiality is something they find bothersome. They yearn for authenticity and depth, not just in conversations, but in relationships as well. In essence, understanding Sigma males and their irritation points is not about labeling or stereotyping, it's about appreciating the diversity of human behavior and personality traits. It's about learning to interact with different types of people in a respectful and considerate way. Remember, understanding someone's irritation points can lead to better relationships, so be considerate when you encounter a Sigma male in your life.